Hi, I'm Russell, and today I'm going to show you how to use Builder to visually build your e-commerce store with the Salesforce Composable Storefront. Builder is a visual CMS that allows you to easily create and maintain your content using a combination of a visual editor, headless CMS, and optimization layer. Builder's unique feature set allows you to break free from the code dependencies traditionally associated with managing a modern storefront. So here in the Builder UI, you can see I'm already connected to my Salesforce demo site. On the left-hand side, I have access to all of my out-of-the-box Builder components, as well as my Salesforce products components that come out of the box in the Builder Salesforce Commerce Cloud integration. So in this use case, I'm going to create a simple landing page that has a hero banner, some content underneath that, and some content from my blog. As you can see, Builder allows me to manage any type of content needed for my Salesforce site. Underneath this hero banner, I'm going to insert a product carousel. The Builder Salesforce Commerce Cloud integration gives me direct access to the product catalog in the Salesforce backend. This enables me to easily merchandise the products I want in this carousel. In addition to working with product carousels and product grids, I can also work with product boxes directly. In this case, I can choose a certain product and have easy add to cart functionality on this page. So that was an example of creating an entire page within Builder. Builder also allows you to work with just certain sections of your Salesforce Composable Storefront site. Here we have a product detail page with a Builder section implemented underneath with full drag and drop capability. So for this page, I'm going to insert a product recommendation block. I'll drag the Einstein product grid here, and I'll call this Einstein Recommendations. You can see in the Builder Salesforce Commerce Cloud integration that we have full visibility into all the different algorithms available with Einstein. So now I've easily used the Builder drag and drop system to add product recommendations powered by Einstein to this product detail page. This page also leverages the targeting capabilities that come out of the box in, this, in the Builder Salesforce Commerce Cloud integration. Here you can see I can select certain categories as well as certain products. So for this use case, we are only showing this product recommendation to product detail pages that are of the men's category. The last thing I want to show you is how you can also schedule and A-B test any content you want within Builder very easily. So for example, let's say I want to test out this algorithm with another algorithm and run that from Monday through Friday. So I specify the schedule here and I select Monday and then Friday at noon. And then I go to the A-B test tab and you can see here that I can add my variations as necessary. In this case, I have a default and two variations, which you can see from this drop down here. From there, I can specify the variation I want to edit, and then just go here and change the algorithm. For example, I might change this to the viewed recently algorithm. Keep in mind that in this example, I'm showing you how to test algorithms, but you can test any content that you create in Builder. So that was just a short overview of the integration between Builder and the Salesforce Composable Storefront. For more details, you can contact either your Builder or Salesforce representative.